Congresswoman Bustos, it's Willie Geist. Thanks for being here this morning. Obviously, the results of those elections will rely heavily on how people are looking at their own lives right now. And for many people in your district and across the country, it doesn't look so good, particularly in terms of the economy. Um, at midnight tonight, unemployed people, some 30 million of them, will lose a $600 a week check that they've been getting that's been floating them through these very difficult times. You all passed a new bill through the House back in May. It's sitting now on the desk of the United States Senate and the majority leader there. Are those benefits just going to expire? And if so, what do you say to those people in your district who are losing those checks? Yeah, you, you laid that out um, accurately, Willie. It, it's been 77 days. Um, literally, uh, you know, we, we, are, we passed this um, 10 plus weeks ago. And, um, and it's got all the tools in there to help the economy uh, keep going, to help our families, to help our first responders, meaning uh, the, the, the nurses, the doctors, the nursing home workers, police, firefighters, all of that get the job done that, uh, that is ahead of us. Um, and, and if you remember, Mitch McConnell said he was going to slow walk this. He was going to take it easy, that there was no sense of urgency. Well, now they come back with some half-baked proposal that would strip away $400 per week for those who have filed for unemployment insurance um, at a time when they can't afford, people can't afford this. Um, we, I can tell you, um, I'm going to be on the phone later today with Mayor Jim Artis out of Peoria. I'm on the phone um, almost weekly with Mayor McNamara out of Rockford, Illinois. These are a couple of towns in, in my congressional district who are desperate to be able to pay their bills, to pay their people, to do things like pick up garbage and make sure that when 911 is called that somebody can respond to that. Um, and, and not to mention the families who absolutely need that extra $600 per week that we added to the unemployment insurance to help families get through this. Um, I, I think it's absolutely unconscionable that Mitch McConnell has not moved on this and then now all of a sudden has this, uh, uh, this little piecemeal proposal that won't even begin to help our families throughout this country. Congresswoman Sherry Bustos, thank you so much. And ahead,